Hello, everyone, and welcome to this week's Tech Tip Tuesday. My name is Victor Moshe, and today I'll be showing you how to use the Health app on your iPhone. So in order to get to the Health app on your iPhone, it comes pre-downloaded, so you don't have to go to the App Store. But if you don't know where your Health app is on your iPhone, for me, it's right here. But let's say you don't know where it is. You could always scroll all the way to the back and search up Health. And this will take you straight to the Health app. So once you log in and everything onto your health app, as over here, it says my name and it tells me uh, all things about me. You'll go to the home page, which is called the summary, and it will show you uh, the amount of steps you take, uh, show all your health trends and highlights throughout the week or throughout the day and show up all your active and energy, walking, running distance, and so much more. You could even set up a medical ID here. So if we look at the bottom, there are three categories, summary, sharing, and browse. You could also go to sharing. Sharing is when you have iCloud on and you could health share with your friends or family. If you're on the same plan, maybe you could, uh, maybe you guys are on a weight loss journey and you want to share how many calories you burned today, how much you've walked, how much you slept, and the health app actually takes care of all of that for you. And you could put in to the health app, if you go back to summary, you could look at articles on health um, and why health matters, more how, about how to improve your health. And at the end, there it recommends more apps for you, uh, maybe if you want to uh, better your health and it helps you with this. If you go all the way to the end to browse, you could look at all the health categories and everything that the health app has to offer. So if you're looking maybe for an uh, for all your activity, so today it's 989 calories that I burned, 5.5 active energy, 201 steps, 0.08 miles, flight climb one floor. And so... You could tell all of your activity, cardio fitness, cardio recovery, cycling distance, and you could put all of this in and it'll track it for you. It may be if you're, like I said, on a weight loss journey, it'll help you throughout this journey and document what you do every single day, how you sleep, how you uh, remain active. And it, and you could also go to heart if you want to, uh, if you have problems with your heart, God forbid, but. Um, you could do medications. If you need help remembering that you need to take some medication, you could put it in here and add medication and it'll, uh, it'll let you uh, remind yourself. And there are so many more things that you could browse. This is just a quick tip, tip Tuesday on all the things that the health app has to offer. And that was this week's Tech Tip Tuesday on how to utilize the health app. If you enjoyed this tutorial and you are interested in enrolling in a full class with us, please visit mittlerseniortech.com. And thank you for watching.